This weighted companion cube will accompany you through the test chamber. Please take care of it. Alright, welcome to uh, How to Get Good, our very first episode. And we're going to be uh, doing Call of Duty 4 today. And I'm um, a W Slayer, all Slayer, some like people like to call me. Alright, let's get going. We, uh, we own, most of us own the PlayStation 3 version, although there are a couple who own the, uh, called, um, the, uh, Xbox version. So, something to keep in mind. Okay, uh, one of the first things you're gonna have to realize is that to be a good Call of Duty 4 player, you're gonna have to practice. You're gonna have to know the maps, know your guns, know everything. Alright, if you, if you just start out with Call of Duty, you're gonna have to go through the first four levels without your created class, which is, uh, your, it's, you know, the main thing you work with. Uh, and you're gonna have to notice a lot of guns. You're gonna have to figure out your feel. I suggest starting out with the MP5, but you know, whatever. Now, once you get past those first to four levels or so, you, you wanna start doing all the challenges. You wanna go up in the ranks really fast. And it's, it's, it's good because you get used to all the weapons good and you, uh, you get a lot of XP. So, you know, it's, it's good for everyone. Okay, I, uh, I suggest when uh, playing Call of Duty 4, you really learn how to shoot people with a sniper rifle very well. You gotta learn how to whip it out really fast, shoot them in the head. Uh, ACOGs, ACOGs for loser. Okay, do you understand? ACOG equals scrub. Uh, when sniping, you know, it's good to get a good spot, but do not, you know, do not sit there for too long because that is like suicide because there's a kill cam and they know where you are. No. Oh, which brings me to my next thing, the top three ways to be a scrub by Fusive and Killer d d d d d And like you guys are over there, and you sit back here, he's like, ooh. Don't camp. Don't sit still like a little scrub in a corner like, ooh. Don't do that crap. Use an M M16, MP5. And the first sniper, M40, A3. If you think that the grenade launcher is a balanced weapon, you're garbage. Do not use Juggernaut. If you think that having more health than the guy you're shooting is balanced, you're garbage. Garbage. While AW Slayer is out harassing little children, I'll take over. My name's Ice Teabagger. Now, for all of you Call of Duty players that are new to this, um, you know, it might be helpful to find some of your friends and create a clan, sort of like me and AW Slayer did. We created the Do Clan, D-O-O. -O. Yes, that's right, we created the clan, and, uh, you know, we go out and we play together, and, and we completely kick butt, and it's because we're friends, and we know each other, and we're not afraid to talk to each other, you know what I'm saying? I'm playing Search and Destroy. And you're the last one to kill the person after the bomb is planted? Make sure you teabag everyone that you can, shoot all your bullets, and don't forget the teabag. So, uh, Brennan, uh, do you have any Call of Duty 4 advice for us? Uh, I don't own it. Really? What, wh why not? I only own a Wii. It's a good system! Garbage! <laughs> Uh, no, well, let me guess, let me guess. He owns Call of Duty 5. Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> For the Wii, what a loser! Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 now here's a 20 second montage of A.W. Slayer killing the crap out of you. Let's go! Woo! UAV recon standing by. Our UAV is online. <laughs> to sign us off, we're gonna have a word from a uh, Bird Slayer 16, who uh, just happens to be with AW Slayer right now, and uh, they're gonna tell us the main differences between Xbox and PS3. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bird Slayer 16. It's pretty. It's a pretty bad name, by the way. Uh. What is the uh, what is the difference between PlayStation Network and Call of Duty 4 and Xbox Live and Call of Duty 4? Well, I've never played on the PS3 network before, but I know from you know previous times of playing Xbox 360 that people like to um, you know talk shit a lot. 
And um, you can get banned for that on Xbox 360. I don't know about PS3. No, uh, no. Can't do that? No, then, can't get banned. Um, it's pretty much the only difference I see between the two. Very noticeable difference. Thank you, first player, and by the way.